Hello, royal folks. It's good to see you all here again. This is your regular dose of royal news and analysis. Before we move on to any further details, I would really love to thank you all for your enormous love and support. And in case you haven't subscribed yet, I mean what are you waiting for guys? Hit that subscribe button now. Also please don't forget to press the bell icon. In the wake of Queen Elizabeth's passing, Prince Harry and Meghan Markle reportedly worked to push back the debut of their eagerly awaited Netflix docuseries. The former royal couple have apparently been in talks with Netflix to postpone the project until next year, according to reports. The former royal couple struck an agreement with the streaming behemoth after stepping down from royal duties in 2020. The Sussex couple, according to a royal expert, have been under Netflix's pressure to delay the premiere of the documentary movie. The decision to suspend the release of the docuseries was made by the streaming service, not the royal couple, according to royal analyst Neil Seen. Speaking on Fox Business in the US, Ms. Seen said that Netflix feels there just isn't enough content yet. He claimed that reports that the Sussexes wanted to cut out uncivilly remarks about the royal family were not accurate. The royal commentator said, On this docuseries, a very good source told me that the bottom line is that there just isn't enough content. You have the Invictus Games in the Netherlands, a bit of footage in New York. He continued, But they are not allowed to use the footage from the Queen's state funeral. And you have a little bit from when they came over for the Platinum Jubilee. I understand why Netflix are wondering what they are going to do with it. It has nothing to do with claims that they are trying to cut uncivilly remarks about King Charles III and Queen Consort Camilla. Sources have previously told Page Six in the US that Harry and Meghan were trying to push the series release until 2023. Harry had made a similar move in regards to his much-anticipated memoir with Penguin Random House. The production was set to be aired in December, according to the Page Six, just a month after the fifth season of The Crown was released. One source told Page Six, A lot of conversations are happening. I hear that Harry and Meghan want the series to be held until next year. They want to stall. I'd wonder if the show could even be dead in the water at this point. Do Harry and Meghan just want to shelve this thing? An insider from Netflix is also said to have claimed, Netflix has been keen to have the show ready to stream for December. There's a lot of pressure on Netflix CEO Ted Sarandos, who has the relationship with Harry and Meghan, to get this show finished. Meanwhile, reports today in the Mail on Sunday claim that Palisades have been discussing ways to stop Prince Harry from publishing his memoir. Royal sources claim that there is deep concern within the palace that the book will contain damaging revelations despite suggestions that Harry is seeking to tone it down in the wake of the Queen's death. So what do you think about this news, guys? Do you think Harry and Meghan's next step could lead to a dead or alive situation from now on? Write down in the comments and let me know. Until then, guess we'll just have to wait and see if things turns out to be something after all. Also, if you never want to miss any of my sizzling royal updates like this, subscribe and press the bell icon. As simple as that. Thank you so much.